Hello and welcome to Chicken Tuesday. I'm sorry it has been a few weeks since I've posted a Chicken Tuesday video. Time has just got away from me. Uh, this time of year there's loads to do in the garden. I've also got quite a lot on with work and uh, things to do in the house. So yeah, uh, I'm afraid I haven't had the chance to video the girls as much as I'd like. Although I have been obviously spending time with the girls and making sure that they are okay. But anyway, I thought it was time to uh, show you the girls so you can see how they're getting on for yourselves. Morning girls. Morning. Hi. Oh, this four are off and running. As always the way now, the four egg layers are all very excited about getting out and investigating where they can find some food. Meanwhile, Hello Hamble, Hamble and Beryl who aren't laying and aren't in the best of health bring up the rear. Hamble's still breathing a bit heavy and has got the hormone implant to suppress her egg laying and Beryl at the back also with a hormone implant and blind just about. Come on then, out you come. Hello darling, you being very noisy? Mm -hmm. How are you? <clears throat> so the first thing the girls do in the morning, or these four anyway, when I let them out, is they come marching round to the deck to see if they can gain access into the kitchen where they can steal the cat food. <laughs> so I've got to be really careful and keep the keep the back door shut. I'm sure that they, given time, they would work out how to use a cat flap if it wasn't locked. <laughs> Isn't that right? Uh huh. So that's Edith and Ems. Then we have Matilda and Jemima. And these are the four girls out of my six that are laying. So they're always very food oriented. You tend to find that when chickens come in to lay, they're, they're actively seeking food a lot more because you know they're burning more calories forming and laying these eggs. Meanwhile, <clears throat> back in the run, Hamble and Beryl are hanging around. They're, they don't lay, so they're not quite so food oriented. 
Hamble has a great little squee noise that she makes. And Beryl, because she's nearly blind, tends to be a bit more vocal. I think just saying, I'm here, where are you? Hi, Hamble. Jemima's come back round. Oh. This is why I've got to sweep up all the time. What a mess. Always rooting around. <laughs> 